In the Wadapur Valley in Afghanistan, two Black Hawks race towards the injured. One shot soldier's condition is critical. The longer troops stay put with the wounded, the bigger target they all become. Two helicopters arrive over a hot battlefield. Insurgents hit the first Black Hawk. They seriously damage hydraulics critical to flight performance. With crucial systems gone, the first Black Hawk must return to base. The medevac helicopter now operates solo. The crew must get the injured soldiers on board, but gunfire below makes it impossible. They hover out of range, around 11,000 feet, and sit tight. But the Black Hawk needs to get on the ground. Casualties mount. It's bad weather, and as dusk turns to darkness, the danger grows. Night vision goggles are the only way for the crew to see what's going on. But they provide little help under such intense battle conditions. Finally, US attack aircraft strike. Enemy fire continues, but it's cover enough for the Black Hawk to attempt a second rescue. They find a narrow opening between trees on the side of a mountain and hover with one wheel on the roof of a house, just long enough to load a critically wounded soldier. The team stabilizes him and gets him to surgery in time to save his life. <laughs> 